Kate and Will's kids set for visible jubilee role as George, Charlotte and Louis step up. Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis have been tipped to attend the jubilee celebrations taking place between June 2nd and 5th. The three beloved children of Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, and Prince William will take a visible part in the celebrations for the Queen's historic Platinum Jubilee, it has been reported. The long bank holiday weekend of celebrations will give the firm the chance to showcase the strengths of its most prominent family members. Among them, Kate is expected to attend Super Bloom, the Tower of London, an event which will see the moat of the historic castle flooded with flowers and turned into a playground by adding a slide. And George, Charlotte and Louis may be at her side. In 2019, the Cambridge children visited the concept garden created by Kate for the Chelsea Flower Show to stress the benefits coming with spending time outdoors and being immersed in nature. The three adorable tots were photographed playing on the swings, running around and with their feet hanging above a small river. George, Charlotte and Louis are also likely to be among the several members of the royal family appearing on the balcony to watch the fly past ending the troop in the color parade on June 2, The Telegraph reports. The three children have already appeared, between 2015 and 2019, on the balcony, but have yet to debut in a more active role during the trooping parade. And royal fans are keeping their fingers crossed this will be the year the Little Cambridges will join adults in the carriage procession. Royal Watcher Royal Aryan wrote on Twitter, My two cents, the Cambridge children will join their mother and the Duchess of Cornwall in their carriage at Trooping the Colour for the first time. Responding to this tweet, a fan account of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge called the Cambridges wrote, Ah, I really hope you are right. Another social media user, Carol Cochran, said, that would be exciting for the children and the public. Similarly, Margaret Parker wrote, Oh this would be truly lovely to see. Also a marvelous experience for the children. Prince William first rode in the carriage during the trooping parade aged four, the same age reached by Prince Louis on Saturday. It is highly unlikely Kensington Palace will announce the attendance of the Cambridge children to any of the events beforehand as they haven't done so also when Prince George and Princess Charlotte took part in the service of Thanksgiving for Prince Philip last month. Other key royals have been tipped to take center stage at various stages of the Jubilee weekend. Prince Charles is expected to take part in most events and, when needed, step in for the Queen. Among other duties, he has been tipped to deliver a speech at the much-anticipated concert at Buckingham Palace on June 4. His wife Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, will lead the big lunch initiatives up and down the country as its patron. And Prince William will review Trooping the Colour in a formal inspection a week before the big event. The Queen is unlikely to attend all the events scheduled for the weekend of celebrations. She is reportedly hoping to be able to take part in a few key events taking place between June 2nd and 5th, including the Epsom Derby. The only British classic flat race her horses have yet to win. Plans are in place to allow the sovereign, who has been experiencing mobility issues over the past months, to be able to attend events as comfortably as possible. A similar approach was taken last month, when the Palace and Westminster Abbey aides made adjustments to allow the sovereign to access the church from a side entrance to cut short her walk through the nave and reach her seat as quickly as possible to participate in the Duke of Edinburgh's memorial service.
and events as comfortably as possible. A similar approach was taken last month, when the Palace and Westminster Abbey aides made adjustments to allow the Sovereign to access the church from a side entrance to cut short her walk through the nave and reach her seat as quickly as possible to participate in the Duke of Edinburgh's memorial service.